Today, I am hitting a fadeaway with Dirk in every NBA 2K, starting with the original 2K, NBA 2K, where Dirk comes in at a 69 overall, the perfect way to start. All right, here we go. We got it to Dirk. He pretty much has no facial features. I don't even know how to fade in this game. That's, that's not it. So if we get in the post here, and then I guess that's a fade. All right, there we go, fade. And there it is. That wasn't much of a fade, but that's the best we can do in the original 2K. So that brings us to 2K1. And Dirk all the way up to an 84 now. So hopefully there's a fade in this game again. We'll get in the post here. And I mean... I guess. On to 2K2. And Dirk so close to the 90 overall here, coming in at an 89. But we'll see what we can do here. There's a fade, and that's our easiest one so far. We're getting closer and closer. We should have that one leg fade soon. NBA 2K3. Dirk up to a 91 overall with a 94 mid range. All right, let's get in the post here. Graphics looking a little better in this game. So maybe his post shot or his fade. How did he just hit that? That was actually a crazy shot. I don't know how he hit that. He hit it two in a row. They're kind of OP in this game. ESPN Basketball, aka 2K4. Dirk a 93 overall with a 94 mid-range. Win the tip off here, nice and easy. It's always different controls in these games. Oh, there we go. That's the nicest fade so far. That was actually nasty. 2K5. Dirk a 93 with a 94 mid-range. All right, let's see what you got this game, Dirk. Fade. Oh my gosh, we got blocked. All right, let's try this again, Dirk. Get in the post here. Fade, and we're blocked again. Like, how do we keep getting blocked on the fade? We're just getting deed up here. Oh, I cannot. I cannot. All right, I got Dirk at point guard now. That way we can stop getting blocked in the post. There, that's got to go. Finally. <laughs> that, that took way too long. We shot one for nine there. 2K6, Dirk up to a 96 with a 96 mid-range. Hopefully it's a little easier in this game. There we go, and first attempt, let's go. 2K7, and this is peak Dirk at a 97 overall with a 96 mid-range. We're not making any progress, put that up, and there we go again. Dirk is just unstoppable in these games now. 2K8, Dirk down to a 95, but still 96 mid-range. Can we post up here? There we go. Fade, and there's that one-legged fade. What we've been looking for. They finally have that animation down pretty good there. Looking a lot better than previous games. 2K9, and Dirk all the way down to a 91. Mid-range only an 88. Now let's see if we can hit this fade on the first try yet again. And we can, man. That, that, it's just so overpowered. And we're on to 2K10. And Dirk only an 83 now. But his mid-range goes up to a 95. Ah, uh, okay. It's L1 in this game, not L2. The post up. And there we go. That didn't look as nice. It's more... I mean, he's getting older now. He's got that slower animation. On to 2K11, though. Dirk an 83 with an 87 mid-range. Okay, here we go. We're in the post here. Let's fade. And there it is. I wasn't sure if that one was going to fall. 2K12. After winning the championship, they boost Dirk to an 85. And he has a 99 mid-range. So with that 99 mid-range, we should be able to hit the fade pretty easy here. Let's get in against Chris Bosh. And there we go. That's nasty. 2K13. Dirk an 85 again with a 92 mid-range. All right, Dirk. Let's see if we continue our streak here of just not missing. We haven't missed for a while, I think. Let's put up that mid-range shot, and it's good. Let's go. Still unstoppable. I wonder if there's going to be a game where, where Dirk just can't hit that anymore. 2K14, and Dirk an 83 overall. He also has a 93 post fade. Let's do this, Dirk. We got Kobe on us. Put that up, and there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That, that fade looks so much nicer than the first one. 2K15, and big rating boost for Dirk here. He's an 88 with a 95 post fade. All right, let's just post up here. Fade. Not the greatest release, but we got it to go. Let's go. I mean, we just get so much separation from that shot. It's hard not to hit it, especially with a 95 rating. 2K16. Dirk an 84, but his post fade goes up to a 97. All right, here we go, Dirk. Even though your overall is low, your fade's so high. Double teamed here, and it doesn't matter. This guy just doesn't miss on the post fade. 2K17. Dirk an 84 yet again. 
And he still has that 97 post fade. All right, let's try this again. Here you go, Dirk. Fade, and there's a green. Let's go. Finally got a green. 2K18, and Dirk down to an 80, but he's still got a 97 post fade. All right, post up here, Dirk. Try to get another perfect release, and we do. It's just unstoppable. 2K19, and Dirk all the way down to a 78, but he still has that 97 post fade at 40 years old. And this is the only game where Dirk isn't a starter. Also, this is his last game on a roster because he retired after this. All right, here we go. Post up with Dirk. Having some trouble here. Fade, not a great release, but it goes in anyways. That 97 rating, it, it's hard to miss with him. We're going to hit one more fade with Dirk in NBA 2K22. Where Dirk is on the all-time Mavs as a 98 overall, and he has a 99 post fade. All right, we got Benjamin covering us here. Let's just fade and the perfect release to end the video. If you guys enjoyed, subscribe to the channel, smash that like button, and I'll see you next time. Peace.